to come back and the shot missed by Wagner. Wolverines do a really good job of mixing up their offense in the half court. They love to get it inside, take it to the basket, but they can also hit it from the outside. We'll pile up the assists. And they both like to spread you out. I mean, there's a lot of similarities between what these two teams want to get done offensively and the inside move by Austin Davis Alito and how Mike Smith pushes. Wagner couldn't handle it. Davis, second chance opportunity. He's big. Dish it. He can shoot it. But his shot selection on his outside shots in this game will have to be sound throughout. And again inside is Austin Davis. Wow. Unstoppable so far. Now Davis L6 of the points for Michigan so far to start. Rollins drives it, draws a little contact, and still able to finish. I like Michigan here early. Wagner working the post now. Inside to Davis, and he hits again. Davis with all eight of Michigan's points. Howard, but still shot 69% from the floor. He's even better tonight, obviously. Littleson, three-pointer on the way. Got it. One of the best outside shooters in the MAC conference. And a very timely bucket. You want to keep this thing as close as you can. Make Michigan, Michigan have to take the ball out. Look at that guy, Davis again. Pick and roll, and Davis has 10. The young players, Wagner just a sophomore. And now River, uh, Livers, Isaiah Livers, a little one-footer, the step back. Smith on the dribble, and now Livers, long shot, hit it, three-pointer. The three-leaguer, where he scored over 1,600 points for Columbia. Granted immediate eligibility here for a fifth year with Michigan. Isaiah. Battle for the loose ball off the missed shot. The lob back for Dickinson, and he gets it. First basket of the game for the freshman, Hunter Dickinson. Homer trying to work on Wagner. Shot clock at five. Leaders having a tough time in that painted area. Nice. Needed that. So you would expect, and we talked about the fact that uh, even in their two losses, they had a good opportunity to win, and they came in excited about this opportunity as Isaiah Livers scored. But uh, Toledo's excited. environment and games being postponed and canceled all over the country. You're thankful for any game you get, regardless of opponent. Davidson. Uh, excuse me, Davis, when he's in there. The two have combined for 14 of the 22 points. In transition from Wagner, the three-pointer. Uh, Link looks at it, though. Yeah. Toledo could start working the ball inside, maybe off the dribble. Nice three-pointer from Acuzo. Wagner puts it up, missed it. A bit of a wild shot. The rebound pulled down, and Jameer Hill goes coast to coast. That time Michigan got caught with nobody back to defend and on the Littleson pressuring Livers. Sean D. Brown Jr. drives it and scores it. 4-0 so far this season, and all four of those wins have come by double figures. And it's a double figure lead now, but a nicely run offensive set from Toledo as his tenured head coach in the Mid-American Conference. Smith beats his man off the dribble. So quick. Yeah. You know, Todd Kowalczyk. And action underneath the basket. Smith works the baseline, and Brown in the paint with 12 footer gets the roll. I like Brown. Livers guarded by Kamagoon. Dickinson trying to post up down on the block and gets it. The freshman. Hunter Dickinson, Seth Ethan, dominant. And now Dickinson gets the block shot at the other end. Terrific freshman. By the way, Michigan with the number one recruiting class of the country for next season as well as Isaiah Livers knocks down the triple. Getting the ball in the middle. They got it in the middle a moment ago and got a pretty good shot, but again, just unable to knock the shot down when they have them. How about Wagner? One minute to play here in the first half. Milner finally wow. ends that run for the Wolverines. Ball, 0 of 7 from the floor. Littleson open, knocks it down. Three three-pointers from Littleson so far here in the first half. 
I would play Jackson if I'm Toledo off the ball. I'd get the ball out of his hands and try and get him moving without it to try and get something going. Early minutes here in the second half. Michigan with a 17-2 run late in the first half, but it's been five unanswered for Toledo here to begin the second half. Toledo, 11 three-pointers made on average this season as Brooks answers with a triple of his own. Ryan Rollins, the freshman, drives it and scores it. Excellent move from Rollins. He had 20 at Xavier. He's been double figures all five games. Starting as a freshman. Hey, there it is, Marion Jackson. First basket. And now defends Milner well. And I like what Davis has done, not just he's on the offensive end, which is where he's going to get the attention for having a career high tonight. But defensively, he's done a nice job as well. Uh, the worst, uh, Jackson misses that free throw, or, or that uh, three-pointer. Mike Smith trying to answer at the other end and does it. Hey. All right, staff here at Michigan. Yeah, Juwan Howard, of course, an assistant for five years to Eric Spolstra in the Miami Heat. As Milner gets the rebound put back, experience yep. as an assistant, but really surrounded himself with a terrific set. I, I like what he's done. And the fact that, as I mentioned earlier, he, he also allows his roll. Nice home court roll here at Chrysler. And now he defends Milner at the other end. Good work from Seth Milner. Now Michigan's getting much better shot attempts. The percentages are high. They're getting it down low. They've got great balance. There's another one inside. Man. Wagner again. Shot clock under five. Got to hurry. And Jackson tosses it up and gets it in just as the shot clock horn sounds. And with the basketball. And there is Dickinson. Oh, man, so strong. Freshman, Wagner is the sophomore. We've got that terrific recruiting class coming in next season. Eli Brooks with the easy deuce. Yeah, that Penn State game here at Chrysler as well. Michigan doesn't play on the road until Christmas Day. As Marenka, Greens are going to. And again, Dickinson trying to bully his way down inside, and he does it. Oh, so impressive. This is America, Luka Garza. Boy, Garza is terrific. But I do like the potential in that matchup. A couple of big bodies. Kamagoom has it blocked. Wow, terrific effort. But Kamagoom gets it back and now feeds Milner for the deuce. The ball, and Kamagoom tries to defend him. All right, he's got a chance to be freshman anymore. Keep this up. Freshman of the year. <laughs> he finishes to play this play. And he finds himself free. Misses this one. And Brooks speeds out of the pack with an easy basket. Taft to really blow it open. And Toledo came out hot to open up the second half. Michigan answered again, and it has been one answer after another. Inching closer to a double-double. Williams throws it away, and Jackson's going to get the easiest look of the night. Well, get, very few people know this, but when Juwan Howard was playing, and you remember the Fab Five, you know how teams schedule exhibition games, and they do it sometimes against uh, eight and teams and stuff like that? Yeah, establishing the culture that they want to establish, and it is a very much of a family atmosphere and unit here in Ann Arbor. 24-point advantage, seven and a half to play. If you're Toledo, you, you come out of this game, try it. I can tell you, the four years that I spent at Michigan State and been able to come in here and compete against the Wolverines and the other teams in the Big Ten, that was some of the best days Do some good things this season for the Wolverines. Having a big game with 15 here tonight. And we talked about as Wagner gets loose. More than anything, this is a great learning opportunity and uh, a great experience for Coach Kowalczyk's club. It's not going to happen, but it still doesn't take away from the experience. 
Thompson again and count it. Plus one. Wow. High school ball there, and it is a Hall of Fame list. You need more than the five minutes left in this game. So I'm going to encourage the youngsters to Google Jamantha High School's greatest, and you'll, you'll see the list. On the interior with their big guys, uh, their guys coming off the bench, you know, just incredible. That's another starting lineup they got over there on the bench. Ron Howard has 10 starters. And there is Williams with the basketball. Another terrific freshman inside and that work in the paint being done by Brandon Johns Jr. Another one of the freshmen. Inside pass from Rollins to Akunzo. Uh, some tips. Some equipment. <laughs> <laughs> the final seconds ticking away and the Michigan Wolverines now 5-0. Jawan Howard's club getting it done 91-71 over the Toledo Rockets.